Hey, what's up YouTube land? Eddie Hill. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today we'll be reviewing Revenge of the Fallen Studio Series Soundwave. But before we look at Soundwave and his display base, we're going to look at the packaging. Here we have some nice artwork shot of Studio Series Revenge of the Fallen Soundwave. Pretty neat, if I do say so myself. Soundwave Studio Series Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Takara Tomy Autobot Logo Generations Transformers Hasbro Ages 8 Plus and there is a bio for Soundwave, if you wish to read it. And there we have his robot mode, his satellite mode, and what he looks like on his display base. That's all there is to say for the packaging. Let's bring up Soundwave. And he is a neat-looking Cybertronian alien satellite, if I do say so myself. He could totally pull off that pose with the flight stand he's got, where he's floating in space about to take out, to take out that satellite. Soundwave acknowledges Lord Megatron. Sorry, I couldn't help the voice, because he's Soundwave. Why wouldn't I make Soundwave, movie Soundwave's voice, speak it out? <laughs> it's fun, and his arms are well articulated. Get some good poses out of this. Pretty awesome, if I do say so myself. That's all there is to say for satellite mode. Time for robot mode. Going to rotate his legs around, straighten them out, flip this up, flip this up, flip that to the side, flip that to the side to form his other arm, rotate. Accordion into place. And finally, here we have Revenge of the Fallen Soundwave in his robot mode. And this is pretty awesome for a studio series figure of the Revenge of the Fallen Soundwave. I love how articulated this figure is. How you can move the head around a lot. I love it. Arm is on a, on a rotation joint. Sorry if I have to correct myself. My autism decided to flare up today. You could totally kick out that far. Kick back that far. So much articulation. And here's a look at his face his display base, and it's pretty cool. And it has Transformers Studio Series 62, Transformers Autobot logo. That's all there is to say for Revenge of the Fallen Soundwave. You're probably wondering, where did I get this? Well, I got them off Amazon for... 13 bucks. You could probably get them for that much still. Is he worth adding to your Studio Series collection? I'd say yeah. Do I have any plans to get the car mode sound wave? Maybe if it goes down for a decent price. And I like this one a lot more. Because he turns into an attack satellite. And that is pretty awesome. 
And that's all there is to say for this review. This is Eddie Hill. Moving on. And rock on and rock out.